go back to the moment when you heard that word guilty. What went through your mind? Were you surprised, shocked? It was their decision. I mean, they made their decision. Like I said, you know, I have to accept it, so I did. Think you were prepared for it? How do you mean prepared? I know, can you be prepared? No, you can't be prepared, I don't think. You just hear it and, and that's it. I mean, go from there. What's going through your mind now? You know, before you go to sleep at night, what do you think about? Just one day at a time, I guess. Just whatever happens, you know, tomorrow, deal with that. I mean, where I'll end up, you know, how it will be, how, you know, spend the rest of my life, I suppose. Is that what you think about? That Sometimes, this... yeah. I'm trying to reassure my brother and sister that uh, I'll be okay, and I don't want them to worry. I want them to go on with their lives because they have families and everything, you know, but uh, that more than anything else. I try, to, I try to prop them up, my brother and my sister. You still have hope? Yes. Hope for what? Well, I don't want to go into that, but, you know, I mean, that's personal, but, you know, hope and faith. And my faith is well-founded, so I'm okay with everything. Think there's still a possibility that you could get out? I don't know. I really don't know. How would you describe yourself? Uh, Good right guy, now, fun guy? Oh, well, yeah, I mean, I love to laugh and make people laugh. I mean, I thought if I could always, you know, maybe make somebody laugh or, you know, give, you know, give them a little something, you know, I mean. You're always joking. Always joking, yes, ma'am. Of Much course, it caught up with me in the end, but, you know. You said it caught up with you? Yeah, because I don't know. I, there's some people that don't like to laugh, I suppose. Don't like humor, don't like to be, you know, uh, don't like to be funny. Much has been made of this dark sense of humor sure. that you have. Explain that to me. It's not the dark sense of humor I have. It's just the way that people in certain occupations have to handle things. The uh, EMS, police, uh, hospital people who deal with, with uh, tragedies every day. You can get by with some things, some things you can't get by with, some things you carry home and, and, and you have to deal with. But on the, on the, on the large part, you know, you try to, uh, try to let yourself off. It's better to laugh than cry. Were you proud of being a police officer? I was proud of being a police officer, yes. Why is that? Well, I don't know. I mean, three or four o'clock in the morning, somebody, you know, you think somebody's breaking in your house, and there we come. I mean, you know, the knights in shining armor, I suppose, so to chase away the bad guys. Do you see yourself as a criminal? No, I don't. <laughs> you still see yourself as a cop? No. No, this, no. I mean, I was, I was chased out of the herd, so, you know, I'm out of the herd. Never to go back again. Never to go back, yeah, you can't. Did you feel like you were doing everything in your power to help find Teresa? I thought I was. I thought I was. But, I mean, when, it's, it's kind of like, I don't know, <clears throat> kind of like the sinking of the Titanic, I guess. I want to help you, but they're after me, and I've got to help me you know, and they, they did not take their eyes off of me. And, and I was, like I said, I mean, here I sit. How would you characterize how you two were getting along at that point? We were getting along great. Even though you were divorcing? Yes. It was amicable? Yes. Let's go our separate ways? Yes, let's still be friends, yes. Even be friends? Even be friends, yes. Go back to the way we were when we first met, yeah. No hard feelings? No hard feelings at all, none. So this, this picture of you as the jealous husband. But I never, you know, I never caused her any, any you know, bad times or, you know, I never, never once ever hurt her or, you know, or anything. I mean, through all of our fights and everything, but. You never hurt her? No, never. Did you kill Teresa Parker? No. Her family thinks that you did and thinks that you could ease their agony by saying where she is. Can you help them at all? No, I can't. 